guys, it's me, Jess Marie. Welcome or welcome back to one of my videos. Welcome to a work week in my life. Full-time Orange Street Fitness Coach, part-time sales associate, and currently 34 weeks pregnant. Today is Monday, February 12th. It is 4.41, getting set up for the day. I'm about to coach the four morning classes, 5 a.m., 6.15, 7.30, and 8.45. And I just got back from Florida yesterday. So always getting back into the group of coaching is kind of hard. Like I just get a little stage fright, if you will. I don't know, but I am really excited to get back into it. I feel nice and refreshed after a long weekend away. And yeah, today's a really good endurance power strength day. Very heavy with endurance on the treadmill. So some pretty long efforts. And I'm trying a different playlist today that I've never used before. So it's kind of scaring me because I feel like the entire thing kind of sounds the same with the same beat, but I'm hoping some members like it. I'm trying to play some new playlists because I feel like I just keep playing the same ones over and over again. So I'm in this playlist group chat with a bunch of other Orange Theory Fitness coaches and someone shared this one. So I'm gonna try this one and see how it goes, especially for 5 a.m. and I might switch it for my other classes. But yeah, just setting up, gotta get my demo station ready, turn on all the rower tablets and check batteries, make sure everything is good. I'll go over the, the VBA practice, what I wanna say for my demos. And yeah, just getting set up. About to take another belly picture because I'm gonna try to take one every week now since we are on the final stretch, which is crazy and scary and kind of exciting. <laughs> so just putting some batteries in the mic pack. Turn it on, bring it green, and then I'll take the headset, put this on, plug the end of it into here. And then I keep this little green thing. I've shared this before, but I always have an earplug, which I need to get a new one, and a mic puff, which I also need a new one because I was sick last week. So I threw that other mic puff that I was using last week away. So I'm just gonna use this one. We should have some more up at the front desk. So I'll go see if we have another one just because I like to keep two at least with me because sometimes these do get gross or they do break. So I'll clip this to my pants, turn the volume on. That way I can check, 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 check. Everything is good. So I'm just gonna get set up. Feel pretty awake today, which is good, especially because we did drive seven and a half hours yesterday and it was Super Bowl. So I was up a little later than normal just watching the Super Bowl, but I ended up falling asleep right after halftime and I had to wake up and ask Justin <laughs> who won. So go Chiefs. But yeah, happy Monday. If you aren't already, be sure to subscribe down below and let's get ready for my classes. It is now three o'clock. I was done with work and got home about 11, but I just felt so tired, so I ended up taking a nap and finally woke up after waking up and going back to sleep for the past four hours. Now I feel nice and refreshed, still obviously a little drowsy, but it is the perfect weather just to be nice and cozy, and since I don't have to work tonight, I just plan on doing nothing all night, except I would like to get in a little workout, either with some dumbbells, some yoga, or if I can, get on my spin bike, but I'm getting more and more sore these days, so we'll see about that, but I don't plan on really doing anything besides chilling. I am about to fold some laundry. Got a lot of laundry here to fold. So I'm just going to turn on a podcast and fold this and that'll be my one sort of productive thing I do today. But I've been saying this every week. I'm just so grateful with how my work is, how I only work really just a few hours and then I get to come home, take a nap. Sometimes I'll have to go back and work like tomorrow and Thursday. I'll work all day. So I'll open the desk and then come home, take a nap for a couple hours and then go back to another studio to coach. But the days like today, where I have to open they are pain because by the end of the fourth class I get so tired and then I come home and just take a nap and that's it so let's get this laundry folded and we'll listen to a podcast Trent. Must be. Lynn is the queen. And it's because, like, his person now. Yeah, the 
It is now Tuesday. It is 4.21. Just got to the other studio I work at to work the desk from 4.30 to 11 today. Usually I work the desk from 4.30 to 10 every Tuesday and Thursday, but today I'm staying a little later because in our last class at 10 o'clock, there are two intros, so I said I would stay. So it's gonna be a pretty long day today. I'll work the morning shift here, go home, take a nap for hopefully a couple hours, at least an hour, and then I have a doctor's appointment at 2.30. So I'm gonna get coffee beforehand and then after my doctor's appointment I coach at the other studio until 8 o'clock tonight because I'll have three classes 4 30 5 45 and 7. Luckily I am off tomorrow so I'll get to sleep in but we are doing deep clean at the studio I coach at tomorrow at 11 I think so once I get up I'll have to get ready to go to that but it's the only thing I'll have to do tomorrow. So yeah, first thing I do every time I get to the studio work, to work the desk is I sign in to all the computers, get OTB ready, reassign everyone's stations at the studio. So I'm gonna erase this and fill it out. And then also I will send the morning report. That is just a report on the day, see if there's any milestones, birthdays to celebrate, all the things. Yeah, then I will just sit here, help with check-ins. I have a cleaning list that I'll do. I'll have papers to scan. Sitting back here. Here. I don't think you can see them, but I'll scan those two members' profiles. It doesn't look like there's a ton. I'll do that, and then at 8 o'clock, I can start making calls, trying to book some new intros. But yeah, other than that, pretty chill. I'm pretty tired this morning. I mean, it is 4.30 in the morning, but I slept pretty good, considering I took a really long nap yesterday. But I hope I don't hit too much of a crash, because like I was kind of talking about yesterday, the longer I work after opening, I start hitting a crash, so hopefully that just makes for a really nice nap later. And yeah, let's get this day started. Can I please have a grande vanilla sweet cream cold brew? It is now two o'clock, just woke up from a nap, now getting Starbucks before my doctor's appointment at 2.30. I hope I have enough time after my appointment to get something to eat on my way to work. Just because I ate the rest of my almonds this morning that I have in my bag and I don't have anything else. So I should have enough time, especially because all these appointments are always like 10 minute appointments. And I'm actually really excited for this one. Usually I kind of dread them just because they're so short, but I'm excited to know hopefully that everything is okay after I was breaking it down at the wedding this weekend. So. That was probably the quickest doctor's appointment I've ever had. I met with a doctor that I've never met before and she just went through everything <laughs> so quickly. But she said the baby is measuring a head currently, but it's still too early to know how much he'll weigh at birth. So I'm hoping he's not gonna be a giant baby. But I'm at work now. I ended up stopping at McDonald's and getting a McChicken because I'm currently obsessed with them. And now I'm full and everything feels very heavy. So I put on my belly band and I'm about to coach three classes. My first class is the strength in tread 50 class. So just got all of the cards on the treads and I'm just going over the template, listening to the playlist and I'm gonna go over the, v the VBA. I can't say that for some reason this week, but gonna go over the VBA, practice my demos, practice how I forecast the treads and yeah, hopefully have some pretty good classes. There's only two people scheduled for the seven o'clock class right now. Seven o'clocks are always very slow. So hopefully more people join other than two. So, updates to come. It is now Wednesday, it is two o'clock 
in the baby's room just got home from deep clean and I think I want to start going through all the boxes I have in here there are a few things that the baby won't even be able to use till he's a little bit older so that I'll just find a spot for but I want to get this room straightened up because Justin's mom is gonna come over this weekend just to look at it and I just want it to look nice and neat and organized and I need to do it eventually so might as well do it today yeah just gonna be a chill rest of the day since it is my day off just gonna relax but also try to get this room finished there's a couple more things I have to wash but I'm gonna wait because there are a few things I have to order still like a boppy cover some velcro swaddles I want to get just some random things that we didn't get that I feel like we're gonna need so let me show you what people got us remember at the studio I coach at she got me two onesies this one says party my crib 2 a.m. bring a bottle and then she got me this one I just did nine months on the inside, my parents are now serving life. And then at the studio, I work the desk at, the same group of members who got us the car seat brought some diaper cream. She said this is her favorite diaper cream, or was her favorite diaper cream, so she got me some. And she also got us these little bears that are little animals that have little blankets on them. She said her kids are older now, but they still have them. So, super cute, adorable. So there's a little fox, a raccoon, and a little bear. Just gonna get this room organized and see what else we get up to for today. I really wanted to get it right. Trying to find some balance in my life. I never really put up a fight. And now I'm losing sleep. What if I lost touch? What if I'll never get it right? I try to follow my heart. Listen to me as I Thursday vlog it is 4:25 at the studio to work the desk until 10 today and my back hurts so bad from doing all of the stuff in the baby's room yesterday by the end of the night I could barely walk like it just hurts so bad I think it's my sciatic nerve and pregnancy is just so crazy because especially at this point I get random bursts of energy and that's how I was yesterday I just got the random urge to do literally everything and then by the end of the day I can't walk because I'm so exhausted but it worked out kind of because I was so tired. I was showered and in my pajamas by 7.30. Finished up making some dinner and then I was just in bed. I was watching the last song and I forgot that movie was filmed in Georgia in Tybee Island and I literally told Justin on the way home from Florida this weekend I wanted to go to Tybee Island because I haven't been since I was a kid. So that was crazy. They also go to the Georgia Aquarium and we just recently went there for the first time and I loved it. So that was just cool. But watched most of that and then at 9.30 I think is when I turned off the lights and the TV and actually went to bed and and I stayed asleep pretty much the entire night. I got up a couple times, but I was able to go right back to sleep. So when I woke up at 3.30, I was pretty refreshed. I did turn off my alarm and try to go back to sleep, but Miley did not let me. She just kept laying on me and scratching me, and she just knew it was time to get up, which was clutch because obviously I didn't need to turn off my alarm. So today I'll work the desk until 10, like I said, and then I'll go home, take a longer nap than I got to on Tuesday, which would be nice, and then I'll have to go coach the three classes 
is at the other studio, 4.30, 5.45, and 7. And tomorrow I just work the two evening classes. I'm happy tomorrow's Friday because then I'm off on Saturday and I just have to work on Sunday. So yeah, it's gonna be a good day. Just about to send all the reports. celebrating a milestone today it is now 4 12 welcome to the studio i coach at we don't even use benches today but i always leave a bench there just to put my weights for my demo so i don't have to bend all the way to the ground but got everything ready turned on also got some coffee because when i woke up from my nap i was still a bit drowsy and yeah feeling excited to coach it feels so good outside right now i literally drove here with my windows open it's just the perfect weather i just want to be outside but tomorrow i'll get to as long as it's still a nice day because i don't have to work in the morning just at night so let's get through these three classes i'm also using a playlist i've never used before so hopefully it goes good but i got it from that coach's group chat that i'm in that we share playlists so <laughs> Hi, girl. Oh. My favorite candle to burn in the morning because it literally smells like a coffee. To add to the coffee smell, of course, gonna make some coffee. Happy Friday vlog. We made it to the end of the week. It's 7.40, I got up a little bit ago because the dogs woke me up to use the bathroom and I honestly feel pretty awake considering I had coffee at four o'clock in the afternoon yesterday and then when I got home at eight, I may or may not had a bowl of ice cream. So I'm actually feeling really good, like I said. So I just got up, I'm cleaning the house a little bit because my sciatic nerve in my back and just my body still aches from the other day. So I plan on relaxing for most of the Day, to be honest so while I have the energy now first thing in the morning I might as well get the house pretty straightened up I mean it's not that messy anyway but I want to wash our sheets and there's just some things that need to be put away so I want to do that before Justin gets home later today he was working out of town this week so I just want him to come home to a nice clean house and yeah so I'm gonna do all that and then just lay in bed and kind of relax for the rest of the day just edit this video and get ready to coach my two classes tonight at 3 15 and 4 I'll coach the strength class first and then a regular orange 60 class and that'll be it Last night, classes were so much fun to coach. The first two were regular Orange 60 classes, and I don't know if it was my coffee or my playlist or just the mix of both, but the vibes were so good. I was having so much fun. The playlist had a lot of like early 2000s pop, and I saw members singing and dancing to it. I was singing and dancing to it. It was just such a fun time. And then the last class at 7 was the strength class and tread 50 class, but there was nobody in the tread 50 signed up. So that went by a little slower only because everyone knew exactly what they were doing and obviously I could offer challenges and correct when needed but honestly everyone looked so good the entire time so I barely had to do that so yeah making my cup of coffee probably will make a bagel or maybe some cereal and yeah just clean up a little and then relax for the rest of the day happy Friday I was also in a little country music mood so I listened to this little country coffee playlist usually I just type in literally morning coffee and that was the first thing that popped up so She always loves looking out the window. Let's get through. Back in the baby's room, I'm finally going to fold this laundry that I cleaned literally a couple days ago. But I also found this other fold-out drawer, whatever it's called, and I'll put all the baby wearing stuff in it. That way it's not just sitting right there. I know where the fourth one is, but it's got a bunch of stuff in the top of our other guest bedroom's closet. So I'll just leave all those stuffed animals right there for now and just put this in here and fold these and hopefully fit them all in the drawer. Yeah. Oh, we like triple. Wow. Oh, 
Thanks, fam. Thanks, everyone. They're on the 14th. Well, it's coming out that day, I know. Finished putting the rest of the sheets in here. We got a couple more from a member at Orange Theory who just gave me them. And then lots of washcloths in here. I also used one of the organizers we have. We have so many. So these are also some towels. And these are just waterproof little mattress covers that I don't have any room for. So I'm gonna try to find somewhere else to put them. But we do have this waterproof cover that's just kind of a pad that I was able to squeeze in there. So it is now 2.53. Just got to the studio and got everything set up to coach my two classes, 3.15 is when the strength and charge 50 class starts and 4 30 is when i'll do regular orange 60. looks like it's going to be kind of a slow evening right now there's seven people signed up for strength only one for tread and four for my orange 60 class so hopefully it'll pick up at least a little but it is friday so a friday before a long weekend because monday i think is president's day so i know a lot of people have off of work so let's see if it picks up but when i leave here i have to get gas because i pulled into the parking lot with literally eight miles till empty which isn't terrible, but I've never let my car get that low before, so. It is now 619, just got home from work and came home to this sweet little surprise, a sappy little love note. I'm just such a sucker for those. And then my favorite snacks, a giant bag, and my favorite candy. Obviously, since he was out of town, we couldn't celebrate Valentine's Day together, but we did send sappy messages to each other the day of Valentine's Day. And just very grateful to come home to that. I do also have a little treat for him. He likes these cookies, so I'm gonna make these right now and figure out what I'm gonna do for dinner. Honestly, I'm not that hungry though. So probably eat a couple cookies and yeah, Let's get to bacon.